Hey guys, James here. Uh, here with a beer review. It's uh, Saturday night. Uh, yeah, today I have a strawberry New England IPA. Wow, cool can art, isn't it? That's by Hope Brewery. It comes in at 6.5% alcohol. And it was canned on 26th of the 3rd, 2019. So it's getting to two, two months old. But I actually bought it about four weeks ago. Just didn't get a chance to uh, drink it. Uh, it doesn't say what hops are here are on it. And doesn't really say anything else. And uh, typical lazy me, I didn't even look it up before I, um, before I started this... Um, this video. So, let's just get straight into it. Just decided to use a different glass today. Looks like a nice glass. Uh, let's get into it. Let's crack it open. Mm. Paul's quite dark actually. Well, not dark. No, it's not quite dark. Oh, there's a lot of floaties. Lots of floaties. Wow, look at that floaties. I have bits of strawberry. I'm getting galaxy. Galaxy mosaic. Not getting any strawberry on the nose at all. Um, it's <clears throat> it's not hazy. It's uh, it's very golden. It's got a bit of it's got a bit of pink hue to it, but pinkish hue. Just like my cheeks on a uh, spring day. So the, I, lo I love the um, I love the aroma in this. So you're getting galaxy and mosaic hops. That's pretty. It, it's just everyone knows what galaxy and mosaic hops smell like. It's just berry and um, pineapple and. Um, Passion fruit. It's quite a, quite a it's quite a nice nose. It's quite soft. It doesn't hit it. It doesn't jump out at you or anything like that. That's just mosaic and galaxy for days. Um, the aroma. Let's just have a sip. Cheers. That is good. It would have been nice to have this a month ago, when it was a bit more fresher. Oh wow, that is really yummy. That is actually really, really tasty. Um, look, strawberry, no. Um, a berry-ish, IPA-ish, New England-ish IPA, yeah. It's uh, definitely got a New England IPA taste to it. Very soft, very pillowy, not very bitter, very sweet, very dry. Very fruity, very... Um, it's really, really yummy, this is. Um, I wish I had had this fresh. Well, a month ago when I bought it. Um... If you can get your hands on this, get it, because it is really tasty. It is really, really yummy. It is. Um, you know what? It's it started to taste a little bit artificial, but I don't really care because it's just yum. It's just yum stuff. It's, uh, it's very good. Um, the mouthfeel is quite thick and chewy. That's why I'm kind of getting the feeling that it's a little bit artificial. But who who really cares? Because it is really tasty. Um, the the malt the malt character, I think it's the malt character that's coming out. That's that's really sweetening it up, sweetening sweetening it up. Because um, I'm ugh, I'm starting to turn a little bit now. Not so. Yeah, it's delicious. It's yummy. I'm not going to try and pull it apart or anything like that. If you can get your hands on this, have a taste. Have a, have a try. Mm. 
Yeah, good. It's good. Go for it. It's yummy. Artificial or not, just go for it. Tasty, delicious, Hope Estate, strawberry, New England IPA. Um, doesn't taste like strawberries. Uh, it tastes like... <laughs> tastes like a... Just a New England IPA, really. That's nothing spectacular, but it's good. That's good. That's yummy. Okay, bye. See you next time.